Hey, I'm Donald Bell, and in this how-to, I'm gonna show you a quick way to run both Metro and desktop modes in Windows 8 at the same time. The trick is to run your system with a two-screen setup and then tweak a few settings. Chances are, if you have a PC that can run Windows 8, it probably supports a second display. Maybe it's a desktop with both VGA and HDMI output, or maybe it's a laptop or an all-in-one with just one display output. Whatever it is, grab an extra monitor and then plug it into the additional port. I also have a more in-depth how-to on this that you can find over at howto.cnet.com. Once connected, you can access the charms bar on the right either by swiping in if you have a touchscreen or hovering in the lower right corner. Select devices, then project to a second screen. Under the second screen settings, make sure that the mode is set to extend. You should notice that your second monitor now shows a desktop view, while the primary display can be used to toggle between a metro menu and the desktop view. It's pretty cool. Now, if you want to do some further tweaks to your display settings, maybe adjust the resolution or change whether the screen extends to the left or the right, you need to find the control panel. Here, I'll go to the File Explorer, select Desktop, then Control Panel. Once you're there, go to Hardware and Sound, then Display. Now, you'll see the classic Windows monitor setup options, and you can click on each monitor to adjust its settings. So there you have it. That's how to run your desktop and Metro interface side by side with Windows 8 using a second monitor. For more Windows 8 tips like this, visit howto.cnet.com. You can also follow me on Twitter or check out the how-to videos I post over on Facebook. For CNET.com, I'm Donald Bell.